Hello everybody, this is Lorraine from Canada with a Verbling class for you at the intermediate level. In this class we will be listening uh, to some audio and studying practical English for staying with other people. Perhaps maybe you go uh, for a few weeks to an English-speaking country to learn uh, English and you stay with a host family. So um, this is the kind of vocabulary we're going to study in this class. So I'll say hi to people as they come in and we have Amparo. How are you today? Hi teacher, hi, teacher. doing well, thank you. Good, good. Nice How to you? see you. I'm very good, thank you. And we have Adela. Hi, Adela. Hey, hello. hello. Nice to nice to see you. I think your camera might be on, Adela. Uh, okay. It yes. might be better to turn it off to uh, save bandwidth. Yeah. Okay. Good. And uh, we have Akaken. Hi, Akaken. Yes. Hello, how are you? I'm good. How are you doing today? Yes, I'm fine. Thank you. Excellent. Nice to see you. And we have Luis. Luis Antonio, how are you doing today? I'm doing very well, teacher. And you? I'm good. Very good. Nice to see you. Nice to see you again. And um, what is the weather like for you, Luis? The weather is cloudy cloudy and uh, very cold outside cold oh yeah. are you're in spain aren't you no i am from brazil oh from brazil <laughs> i'm sorry i'm sorry okay so yeah different there but i thought brazil would also be hot <laughs> yeah but i live in south e southeast region of brazil Okay, so that's getting into. Um, are you going into winter where you are, or? Uh, yes, uh, twenty twenty first of this month, we are mm -hmm. getting get into a uh, winter season. Yeah, it's so odd for me because that's our summer season, and I forget oh. that on the other side of the world it's winter. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, well, I'm glad you joined us. Thank you. Hi, Vu. How are you doing? Hi, again, teacher. I'm doing well. Oh, good. Nice to see you again. Yes. And we have Osama. How are you doing, Osama? Hi, teacher. I'm good. Good, good. Nice, nice, to, nice to see you. Yeah, nice to see you too. Welcome. Okay. And, um, Lau? Can you say uh, your name for me, please? <laughs> well, uh, yes, nice to see you. My name's pronunciation is Law, like uh, L E A W. Law. Okay, Just. Law. All right, good. Uh, Thank no you. Problem. That makes it uh, nice to much see you. easier. Good to see you. Where are you from, Law? I'm from China. Oh, okay. Very good. What's the day like today in China? Um, actually, the day like today, I can just uh, speak of my city, and it's like yes. a, a cloudy day. <laughs> yeah. Cloudy day for you. Oh, yeah. it's a beautiful sunny day for me today. So, I'm yeah. not teaching Good. this afternoon. Yeah. I'm going to go out and enjoy the day. <laughs> All right. So let's get started with our material. I have posted the worksheet in Verbling Chat, and here it is in Google Chat for those of you who would like it. Also, I will screen share my PowerPoint with you. Okay. So the PowerPoint is blue. It says staying with people. If you can't see it, let me know. Okay. Yes. Here we go. First of all, we're going to um, define some vocabulary. Let's see if you can explain the difference between the following words and then we'll complete the sentences with them. So first of all, uh, let's uh, go with Adela. Number one, read that and tell me what is the difference between these two things. Uh, landlord and uh, tenant. Uh, 
I think is when a person rent an apartment or a flat. The landlord is uh, who rent. The tenant is the owner uh, rent which uh, rent the apartment. Okay, so the landlord owns the apartment. And the tenant rents uh -huh. oh, the apartment. Okay. Yes. Okay. <laughs> yes. I think that's yeah. what you meant. <laughs> yes. Okay. So the landlord owns it, and the tenant rents it from Rent. the landlord. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Good. Uh, Aka Ken, number two. Okay. Host and guest. A host and guest. Mm hmm. So what's a host and what's a guest? Well. Uh, Host is a uh, kind of the owner of the home, or mm -hmm. and if the host uh, invite a guest, uh, how can it <laughs> invite the people okay. that could be they could be a guest? Of okay, I can tell from your answer that mm -hmm. you understand the difference. It's just hard to explain it. So if we say there's a party, the host holds the party, and the guest attends the party. It can also be that a host is going to um, have guests come and stay at that person's house. So that's why if you, um, if you go to another country and you stay with a host family, you are the guest and they are the host. Okay, good. Amparo, number three. Uh, flatmate that is uh, someone who who shares a, a flat or an apartment, mm -hmm. and a next door neighbor is uh, who live uh, close. Okay, mm -hmm. good. Yeah, yeah, very good. Yeah. So a flatmate shares your house or flat, and a neighbor lives in a house or flat near yours. So it's your next door neighbor. Next door um, literally means the next house over, but uh, it can be anyone fairly close, maybe across the road from you, or even two doors down would still be a neighbor. Okay. Uh, Who's next here? Ishmael, hi. <laughs> Welcome. Hi. Oh, hi. and Joy's there too. Yeah. Okay. Welcome, both of you. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, Ishmael, can you tell us about number four, please? Read it and then explain the difference. Live somewhere and stay somewhere. Uh, for example, I live in in Ankara uh, in a city, and I stay in an apartment building. Okay, uh, it's not quite the way it works. It's it's a little bit different than that. If you mm -hmm. live somewhere, this is your permanent home. Okay, so when somebody says, I live in Canada, it's the permanent home. But sometimes I stay in Mexico for the winter. Okay. So what would stay mean? Uh, stay mean, uh, for example, if we live in another country for a, a short time maybe yes exactly a short time okay. so living somewhere you are a permanent resident and staying somewhere you're a temporary resident okay you don't for stay there for we stay for uh, we are staying uh, at hotel All right yes we're staying in a hotel we're staying with friends Okay. We're staying in an apartment in Mexico for two months. So something where it is temporary. It's not your permanent place to live. Okay, Joy, number five. Yes. Uh, I think all of that is um, when you 
pay a lot of money to uh, be on the Okay, Joy, unfortunately, we lost your audio. We can't hear you. Yeah, we can't hear you. I'm sorry, Joy. Um, Luis, can you uh, explain number five, please? Rent a flat is when you don't have your own house or flat or apartment. Okay. Oh, no, 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 sorry, sorry, sorry. You rent a flat when you don't have your own house, apartment, or flat. In this case, you rent a flat from a landlord. Right. Okay. And on a flat is on your save up money in order to, to buy a flat or house mm -hmm. or apartment. Right, okay. And actually, you also may be paying out money to a bank for a mortgage, yes. but you own the flat. It belongs to you, but when you rent the flat, somebody else owns it, and you just rent it from them. So you pay a landlord monthly, or you purchase the flat yourself. Okay, good. Um, law number six. Move in and move on. Uh, move in is to you want to move in a new house, and move out is you don't want to stay there anymore, so you want to move out to <laughs> okay. another yeah. new house. <laughs> okay, right. So when you move in, you begin living in the place, and when you move out, you stop living in that place and you go somewhere else. Good. Okay, so now we're going to use all of these different uh, words in sentences. So starting with Osama, can you read the first sentence and put the correct word on the line? Okay. John's flat was too far from his office, so he decided to move out and look for somewhere, somewhere new. Good. Okay, he's going to move out. Excellent. Uh, Vu, the next sentence, please. Um, oh yes, wait me a, wait me a minute. Um, my my flatmate visits me at the beginning of each month to collect his rent money. Hmm. Maybe hmm. not your flatmate. <laughs> <laughs> you paying your flatmate the money? <laughs> you pay somebody else every month. Who is it you would pay? Um, may I use uh, different uh, work uh, mm -hmm. from? Uh, yes. Yes. Uh, my father. Okay, so you pay your father money every month for rent. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's possible if your father is your what? Mm. The person who owns the property. What do we call him? Oh, yes, my landlord. Yes, landlord. Yes. And your father might be your landlord. It's possible. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Adela, the next one, please. We were uh, invited uh, to uh, stay uh, with Mr. Nakamoto at his flat in Tokyo. Okay, good. Uh, Amparo, can you read the next part of that sentence, please? Our host was very generous. He treated us well and cooked us a wonderful meal every night. Mm, that does sound like fun. Good, well done. Ismail, the next one. Do you rent your flat? No, I don't. Okay, uh, good. Uh, Joy, can you continue with that sentence? No, I don't. I... Mm, if you don't I'm, own, you... I'm moving. Um, 
I rent. Okay, I rent it with. Okay. With three. Um. Flatmate. Flatmates, yes. I rent it with three flatmates. Good. Okay, Luis. Who's that guy stand outside the house next to yours? I never seen him before. That's my new next door neighbor. Good. He, mo he moved in yesterday. Very nice. Well done. Thank you. Okay. So I'm going to play the audio now. This audio is about Simon, who has a visitor from Italy. So we're going to listen first, and then the second time through, we'll listen to put the words on the lines. Okay, so everybody should have their microphones muted. <clears throat> Part one, here we go. Hello, John Luca. Come in. Let me take your coat. Thank you. It's freezing out there. Yes, it's not usually this cold at this time of year. How was your flight? Just fine. No delays this time, luckily. Glad to hear that. You have a lovely place here. Thank you. It's just been redecorated. Make yourself a home. Okay. We'll listen to it one more time and then we'll put the words on the lines. Hello, Gianluca. Come in. Let me take your coat. Thank you. It's freezing out there. Yes, it's not usually this cold at this time of year. How was your flight? Just fine. No delays this time, luckily. Glad to hear that. You have a lovely place here. Thank you. It's just been redecorated. Make yourself at home. Okay. So, uh, let's see. Law, we'll start with you. What does Simon say on the first line? Hello, Gianluca. Um, come in. Let me take your ho coat. Good. Let me take your coat. Excellent. And Gianluca says, thank you. It's freezing out there. And Osama, what does Simon say? Yes, it's not usually this cold at this summer time of year. How was your flight? Very nice. Okay, and Gianluca says, just fine. No delays this time, luckily. And Boo, what does Simon say? Oh, glad, glad to hear that. Yes, glad to hear that. Gianluca says, you have a lovely place here. And Simon says, what, Adela? Adela, are you there? Oh, she must yes, have. Sorry, uh, she I, I say the, the first. Thank you. I just been redecorated. Uh, make yourself at home. Okay, make yourself at home. Excellent. All right, so now we're going to listen to the second part of the dialogue and fill in I the I brought blank. you some Sambuca. It's a special drink from Italy. Thank you. That's very kind of you. Can I get you something to drink? Uh, yes, please. A coffee would be nice. How would you like your coffee? White, please. Do you take sugar? Just one. Here you are. Would you like to eat lunch now? No, thanks. I'm all right. I ate on the plane. But could I just try one of those biscuits over there? They look very tasty. Yes, of course. Help yourself. Thank you. Oh, before I forget, could I check my email from your computer? I'm expecting an important message. I'm afraid the internet isn't working at the moment. Okay. I'll just make a quick phone call, if that's all right. Sure. Go ahead. Okay. So let's see if we can finish off these sentences. Uh, Simon and... See, it's Amparo's turn. Oh, thank you. That's very kind of you. Yeah, very kind of you. Uh, Ismail, uh, Gianluca says... Can I get something to drink? Oh, do Gianluca with the line. 
We're just going oh, yes, to fill in these. A coffee would be nice. Would be nice, yes. Okay, and then down to where Simon, uh, Joy. Yes. Um, take. Yes. Can you read the line, please? Do you take sugar? Very good. Okay. And then down to this line for Gianluca, uh, Luis. Luis? Luis, yes. Yep. No thanks. I'm all right. I ate on the plane, but I, but could I just try one of those biscuits over there? They look very tasty. <laughs> okay, very good. La, Simon. Uh, well, uh, yes, of course. Take yourself. Not take. Uh, help yourself. Yes, help yourself. Good. And then again down to Simon's line, Boo. I'm afraid the internet isn't working at the moment. Okay, good. And then the last line, um, Adela. Adela, are you there? Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sorry. Uh, 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 sorry, is uh, uh, the shoot. last line. Yeah. Go ahead. Go, go ahead. ahead. Okay, go ahead. All right. So we'll go back to uh, this one, and I'm going to get Amparo and Ishmael to do this um, this little dialogue together. So Amparo, you can be Simon, and Ishmael, Gianluca. Go ahead. Hello, Gianluca. Come in. Let me take your coat. Thank you. It is freezing out there. Yes, it's not usually this cold at this time of year. How was your flight? Just fine. No delays this time, luckily. Glad to hear that. You have a lovely place here. Thank you. It's just been ridiculated. Make yourself at home. Okay, very good. Thank you. Okay, and whoops, I lost all my. All right. Uh, Joy and uh, Luis, you're going to go halfway down just to where uh, Jen Lucas says just one. So, Joy, uh, you can be Jen Luca and Luis Simon. Go ahead. Okay. I brought you some Sambuca. It's a special drink from Italy. Thank you. That's very kind of you. Can I get you something to drink? Yes, please. A coffee. Would you be nice? How do you like your coffee? Why, please? Do you take sugar? Just one. Okay, good. Thank you very much. And La and Osama, you're going to continue to the bottom of the page. La, you can be Simon, and Osama, Gianluca. Go ahead. Here you are. Would you like to eat lunch now? No, thanks. I'm all right. I ate on the plane. But I could I, but could I just try one of the, those biscuits over there? They look very... Yes, of course. Help yourself. Hello? Hello? Osama, I think we lost you. <laughs> Osama? <laughs> oh, dear. This is funny. Okay, Vu, can you just finish off um, instead of Osama? Um, am I on? Uh, well, with uh, with law. Uh, uh, okay, I'm I'm law. So I'm waiting for Wu Wu. Um. Who am I? Okay, uh, law. Who were you? In, I'm Simon. Okay, so Wu, you're Gianluca. Okay. Okay. 
So we've already had John Lucas says they that he wanted the biscuits, and Simon has says yes, of course, help yourself. So John Luca, go ahead. Thank you. Oh, before I forget, could I check my email from your computer? Um, expecting an important message. 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 Good. I'm afraid the internet isn't working at the moment. Okay, I just I just make a quick phone phone call if that's all right. Sure, go ahead. Okay, good. All right, so that gives you a little bit of practice um, having a dialogue about you know somebody coming and staying at your house. Now there are expressions in the dialogue. Some of the expressions make a request. So, Amparo, can you see um, an expression that is making a request? I'll give one example for you so you know what I'm asking for. Could I just try one of those biscuits over there? That's a request. Do you see another, Amparo? Could you please open the door, please? Could you please open the door? Is that in the dialogue? I don't remember seeing that. I know. Ah, you went there from the dialogue. <laughs> from the dialogue, yes. But so, you're right. That is certainly a request. <laughs> uh, I, I don't remember. I have to see the, the dialogue. <laughs> well, you can look at the uh, worksheet in yeah. group chat or Google chat, whichever. Wait a minute. Can I get uh, something to drink? Okay, that's not a request. Not no, no. Mm. <laughs> it's an offer. It's an offer. That's right, you're right. Could I check my email from your computer? Yes, that's a good one. Mm -hmm. Sorry. <laughs> okay, and I'm not sure if there might be one more. Yes, this is a little bit different. It's making a request, um, but it's not a question. So I'll just make a quick phone call if that's all right. So that is part of the request. If you don't include if that's all right, then you're making a statement where the host has no choice and that would be rude. So you need to soften it by this is sort of um, giving an out to the host because the host might say actually um, I would rather you didn't make a phone call because it's long distance and I don't have a good long distance plan or something like that. You give him the opportunity to say no. <laughs> okay, They probably won't say no but you always have to give that opportunity. All right, Ishmael, can you see anywhere where uh, there's a request accepted? An expression accepting a request. Ishmael, are you there? Yes, I am here, uh, okay. Lorraine. Right. Uh, here you are. Do you uh, want sugar? Just one. Here you are. For example. Uh, well, let's see. Uh, when you when you make. Yes, of course. Uh, yes, of course. That. That's what you want. Yes, of course. Help yourself. That's good. Yes, that is accepting the request. Sure. Right. Okay, just sure. the one. That's good. Okay. You did. Did well, super. Uh, Joy, can you find another acceptance of a request? Um, go ahead. Go ahead, yes. Very good. 
Thanks. All right, Luis, refusing a request. Let me see. I'm afraid the internet isn't work at the moment. Yes, I'm afraid. So if you start the sentence, I'm afraid um, you can't have one of those biscuits because <laughs> they're poisonous. Yeah. Okay, so <laughs> you, you start with I'm afraid and that is a softening thing instead of saying no. Okay, it's it's kind of not great to just say no. It's a little rude. So I'm afraid is making it softer, saying, mm, I wish this weren't the case, but, okay, I'm afraid. All right, I don't know if there's another one. I don't think so. Uh, so Osama, making an offer. Okay, Law, are you there? Yes, I'm here. Okay, can you do making an offer? Can I get you something to drink? Mm -hmm. Can I get you something to drink? Uh, Osama? Yes, can you, can you hear me okay? There, okay, yes, yes, good. Uh, can you okay. find... Where, an, where am I? <laughs> uh, making an offer, can you find another sentence that is making an offer in the in the dialogue. Mm. Can I just get something to drink? Would you would you like to get something to drink, for example? Yeah, we have that one. Can I get you something to drink? But there are other examples in the dialogues that we read. You can. Uh, you can download the document by the link in Google Chat or Verbling Chat. Both of them are there. Yeah, I have it. Okay. So, in that section about the drink, he's giving coffee, there are other offers made there. Do you want to, for example, something? Um, read the line. Do you, do you take sugar? Yes. Do you take sugar? Or would you like to eat lunch now? Ah, okay. Uh -huh. Okay. How do you like your coffee? <laughs> okay. okay. So, whoops. I shouldn't be on that one. <laughs> ah, I'm having troubles here. Ah. Okay. That's the problem with PowerPoints. And okay, so uh, Vu, how about accepting an offer? Uh, accepting it. Mm. Thank you. That's very kind of you. Yeah. Okay, uh, Emparo, do you see another? Accepting of an offer? Mm -hmm. uh, yes, please. A coffee would, uh, would, would be nice. nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yes, please. Okay, and I think there's one more. Uh, Ismail, can you see another one for accepting an offer? Yeah. Maybe right at the very end. Here you are. Mm. No, that's offering something. Here you offering. are. Yeah. So it's the other person. It's uh, it'll be um, accepting. Yes. Yes. Uh, so this is the guest. The things that he says. Thank you. Uh, yeah, thank you. We've got that one. Okay, maybe it's uh, that was all we had. Oh, yeah, that's very kind of you. Thank you, and then that's very kind of you. Yes, please. 
so declining an offer the only example I could find was no thanks I'm all right oh, thanks. Um, okay so now comes practice so I want you to practice making accepting refusing uh, requests and offers so let's try law with Amparo so law you can be um, you can be the host Amparo you're the guest so law I want you to welcome your guest well good to see you um, help you self uh, as your home oh thank you so much uh, let me give you a, a bottle of wine that I I bring for you. Uh, uh, you you'd like to have a bottle of uh, wine? What wine you prefer? Red no. wine or white wine? Law, she offered you a bottle of wine. She brought a present. Yeah. Yeah. Here's oh, here's a yes. bottle of wine I brought for you. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I think I'm a host, so I have offered him a wine. Yes. Okay. Um. Uh. Okay. That's great. Um. So please come in and uh, have a seat. Uh, Thank you. Would you like to? Yeah. Would you like to have some drinks? Yeah. A glass of yes, please. A, a glass of water would be great. Okay. Um. Please wait a moment. Here you are. Oh, thank you so much. Oh, what is new? Uh, what? Pardon? She, she asked, what's new? What's new? Yes, what's new? <laughs> uh, this this is own... small talk now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what's new? Uh, actually, our old friend Tony has just uh, gone, so I, unfortunately. Yeah. Uh, did why? he... Die or did he move out? <laughs> um, what? Well, uh, it's uncertain. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now that's great, guys. We'll leave it there and let another couple try this. So we'll do uh, Ismail and Vu, please. Uh, Vu, you will be the host. Ismail, you're the guest. Go ahead. Uh, nice to meet you, Ikmeal. Hello, Will. Nice to meet you. Yeah, How are yes. You? I'm well. How about you? I'm doing well. Thank you. Uh, okay, yes. guys. Would you like? Would you like to? Would you like? Would you like to take some drink? Yes. Uh, do you have black coffee? Yes, I have. Yes, how do you like the coffee? Uh, white, please, with one sugar. Okay, uh, wait me a minute. Here we are. Here we are. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> Okay. All right. That's yeah. good. We'll we'll leave it at that. That that's good. Okay, Vu. Uh, when you are offering something, um, yes. don't use the word take. take. Would you like a coffee? Would you like a coffee? Would you like something to drink? Yes. Yes. Something to drink. Not. We don't take drinks in English. <laughs> <laughs> okay. We take a bath. <laughs> But we don't take drinks. We uh, have something to drink. Okay. Yes. yes All right. Okay. Good. So let's try Luis and Joy. Uh, Luis, you can be the host, and Joy, you're the guest. Hi, Joy. Please come in. It's very cold out there. Excuse me. I. Can you talk again? I don't understand what we are doing. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Hi, hi, Joy. How are you? Please, oh. please oh. come in. It's very cold out there. Thanks, Luis. Nice to meet you. Okay, Joy, 
Luis has yep. just invited you into his home. So uh -huh. it's he said it's cold outside. Come in. And you come in. What do you say? Mm. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Go ahead, Luis. Please, Joy, have a seat. <laughs> Joy, he okay. said, have a seat. He wants you to sit down. Okay, um, thank you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Joy, would you like to watch something on TV? Um, yes, of course. Okay. I am I, uh, I'm turned on, on the TV. And uh, uh, would you like a, a, hot, a hot cup of coffee? Yes, please. Uh, okay. with, with sugar or not? Um. Do you take milk and sugar in your coffee? Yes. Okay, that's what he is asking. Okay. Please, please hold on. I I'll be back in in a sec. Joy, here you are. A hot uh, cup of milk. <laughs> okay. All right. We'll we'll leave it at that. Thank you. Good. We Thank will you. be doing more of this, but a little later on. So here we have some sentences to help you. Um, they are questions and statements and uh, different things to say when you are um, when you hear these kinds of sentences uh, or questions. Okay, so we'll start with vu. Um, you're going to read the uh, statement or question and then match it with a good answer. Okay? okay. So many of things that people say in English when they are greeting one another, um, they are um, they're just standard things. Okay. If somebody says hi, how are you? You say I'm fine, thank you. Even if you have a terrible headache and uh, your cat just died, you don't say to anyone, actually, I feel lousy, I feel terrible. We always say, fine, thank you. So these are set things to say, okay? Go ahead. How was the weather in Madrid? Um, not too bad. It's quite mild at this time of year. Okay, that word is mild. It's quite mm. mild. Do you know what that word means? Mm, maybe a west. A mild is west. to do with temperature. Mild means it is not very cold, but it's not very hot. So it's mm. just mild. Okay. Okay, teacher. Not hot, not cold. Good. All right, Law. Number two. Oh, oh well, I just <laughs> something in chat box. Okay, number two. Oh, I'm sorry. Then, uh, well, just answer no, 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 this no and then go. <laughs> no problem. Okay. Dinner, dinner is ready. Dinner is ready. Let me see. Um, mm, it smells delicious. Good. Okay. Nice thing to Thank say. Thank you. And uh, okay, I hope have you have all go. enjoy the rest of your, of your day. Bye-bye. <laughs> okay. Bye-bye. <laughs> Thanks for joining. Okay, Luis, number three. Number three. How do you like our series so far? Very impressive. Yes, very impressive. <laughs> Not, oh, I think it's a dump. <laughs> 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 okay. Uh, number four, Joy. Uh, did you have any problems finding us? No, actually, I've been here several times. Um, no, I think there's a better answer for problems um. finding us. 
Did you have problems? The answer to that is going to be either yes or no. Oh, maybe um, not at all. I yeah. took a taxi straight here. Okay, so that answers whether or not there were problems. There were no problems because the taxi uh, knew where to go. So that's a good one. Now sometimes this question you might tell somebody that you had difficulties especially if you are late arriving then they'll say did you have any problems and they, yes actually the taxi got lost we ended up on the other side of the city that is appropriate but only if you're late <laughs> okay Ismail number five is, there, is this your first visit to London no, actually, I have been here several times. Good. Mm. Yes, excellent. Amparo? Uh, let me give you a lift to the airport. Thank you. I uh, appreciate that. Okay, good. And Vu, number seven? Thank you for having me. Mm. Not at all. It was a pleasure. Good, yes. Not at all. It was a pleasure. Very good. And Luis, number eight. You must come and have dinner with her sometime. Thank you. I'd love to. Okay, very good. All right, so are there any questions about those sentences and responses? All right. So here we go, we're going to practice a little bit more. So this time we have a little more instruction. For the host, you're going to welcome your guest and make some small talk. Small talk can be about the weather, about mutual friends, um, asking any kind of questions, that sort of thing, like just small talk, okay? And the guest it is up to you to respond to the small talk. And then uh, a host, I want you to say yes to two requests and no to one. And the guest, it's up to you to make three requests. Okay. And then at the end, uh, the host will offer a lift to the bus station and the guest will thank the host. Okay. So let's put uh, Amparo with Vu. Uh, Amparo, were you guest or host the last time? I was the guest. Okay, so you're the host this time. And Vu, you will be the guest. Okay. okay. Bye. Hi, Vu. Welcome home. Um, Hi. How, how, how was your flight? Oh, it was nice. Um, uh, uh, the fly, my fly is uh, on time. Mm, so, uh, uh, so yes. How do you uh, feel with the weather here? It's so hot today. Um, mm, it's uh, it's normal to me. Um, uh, would, uh, do you have? Uh, mm -hmm. Uh, do you have a uh, uh, a train, a waiter? I'm sorry, Vu. I didn't understand yes. what you asked. <laughs> Could you ask again, please? Um. Um. Can I have uh, a train? Okay, Vu. Yes. When you ask a question like that, um, it's a better idea to use could rather could. than can, okay? Yes. Both are correct, but could is a little more polite than can. Could I have okay. a drink, please? Yes, yes. Okay. Okay, sure. Let me bring you. Um, you do you prefer uh, lemonade, uh, lemonade or a soda? Yes, of course. I I try uh, le lemonade. Could you give me a little bit? Sure. 
It would be a pleasure. Um, Thank you. Do you want the uh, eyes on on it? Uh, yes, yes, of course. Um, okay, in this uh, case, Vu, you can say yes. That would be nice. That would be nice. Yes, that would be nice. Good. Okay, and make another request now. Um. Um. Can I borrow you uh, a mobile phone? I want to uh, call call my uh, mother. Yes, make yourself. Mm, thank you. Thank you so much. Were you able to talk to your mother? Um, because I. I I miss her, and it's, uh, it was a long time I uh, am uh, not uh, keep contact with her. Yes. I okay. So make one more request now, um, oh, Boo. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Maybe um, we'll cut it down to uh, just two for the next time, but make one more so she can say no to you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, could you... Uh, Give me uh, a, pen. a pen. I need to write something, yes. Well, uh, even when you are not relieved, I don't have any pen now. <laughs> <laughs> Usually I just write on the computer, so I forgot uh, to buy a, a pen. Sorry. <laughs> I can't help you. <laughs> my, my, but maybe uh, I, oh, no, I can no. give you a lead to, to the bookstore or to, to, to buy some. Okay, okay, no problem. Yes, I, I will uh, take a leaf to uh, the station. Okay, so you just say thank you. That's thank very you. kind of you. Thank you. That's very kind of you. Okay, You're welcome. good. <laughs> All right. So it's it's harder, I think, when these situations are not real. So it, it's hard to think of things to say. Uh, but this time we'll get uh, let's see, Ismail and uh, Joy. Okay, Ismail, were you the host or the guest last time? Ismail, are you there? Yes, Lauren. I was a guest last time. Okay, you'll be the host this time. Okay. Okay, so we're going to just... Um, uh, Joy, you will only make two requests, and Ismail, you have to accept one and uh, refuse one, okay? Okay. All right, go ahead. Joy, welcome. Come in. Okay, thanks. Uh, how's your family? We are doing well. How are you? Let's have oh. a seat. Very good. Long time to see. Nice to see you. Um, How was your travel? Oh, good. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to something to eat or drink? Are you oh. angry? Yes. Could I have a drink, please? Okay. Maybe um, milk. I like milk. Sure. Um, okay. Just a minute. Here you are. <laughs> okay. And could I turn on a TV? Oh, no. Uh, my TV is... <laughs> Down. Okay, Ismail, remember, try not to say no if you no. can. You okay. say, oh, I'm sorry. Uh, oh, I'm, I'm afraid sorry. my TV is broken. <laughs> I'm afraid uh, my son has broken the TV. <laughs> oh, sorry work. to hear that. Oh, sorry to hear that. <laughs> okay. It's not important. Okay. I can turn on some music if you want. Okay, thanks. 
All right, so you've been there for a while, and now, Joy, tell your host that it's time for you to leave. Oh, I think it's too late. I've got to go see you tomorrow. Do you want to give a ride for you? Okay. For do you me? want do you want me to give you a ride to the station? Do you want do you want me? Do you want me to give a ride to the station? Good. Joy? Joy, do you want to know? <laughs> I think Joy has gone. Really <laughs> I think she's gone. <laughs> <laughs> With light speed, Lorraine. <laughs> oh my goodness, our class is getting smaller and smaller. Okay. Um, Joy? Yes, yes. Can you hear me? Yes, okay, you're there. Oh, sorry. So, he said he would like to give you a ride to the station. What do you tell him? Oh, 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 no, thank you. Thank you very much. Um, see you soon. Okay, are you, going, are you going to accept a ride to the station? Oh, uh, no. No? Okay, no. then you say, <laughs> then you say, <laughs> you say, <laughs> Yeah, then you say, um, uh, oh, no, that's okay, I'm all right, I can get to the station, it is not far, something like that, okay, if you're going to say no. All right, you just uh, try to make it soft, try not to say the um, yes or, or no, Don't try not to say no if you can help it. Um, <laughs> use other words besides no, I'm afraid, I'm sorry, things like that. You can say no without actually saying the word and making it sound very blunt. Anyway, I'm afraid that we have run out of time and so I have to go. Thank you so much for joining me and hopefully I'll see you again uh, next week. Take care everybody. Bye-bye. Thank you, Richard. Thank you. Thank you.